Congratulations! Whether you just had a baby, expecting a new baby, or taking care of a young infant, it's important to create a safe sleep environment for your baby. Hi, I'm Nikki Fleming, spokesperson with the U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission. Today, I'd like to take a few moments to show you how to create a safe sleep environment for your baby. The safest place for your baby to sleep is in a safe crib, bassinet, or play yard. These items should never be placed near a window as they create a serious fall hazard and a risk of strangulation on window blind cords. Additionally, please remember these safe sleep tips. To reduce the risk of SIDS and suffocation, place your baby to sleep on his or her back. Do not place your infant to sleep on their side because this is an unstable position and the infant will tend to flip onto their stomach. This is an important recommendation from the Consumer Product Safety Commission and the American Academy of Pediatrics. Never place your baby to sleep on top of pillows or comforters. Remove these items from the crib. In fact, the vast majority of deaths associated with an unsafe sleep setting are caused by a combination of using extra bedding and placing a baby to sleep on his or her stomach. Make sure the crib has no loose or missing parts or slats. Cribs with broken hardware or even a missing screw can have their side rail become disengaged, allowing your baby to get caught between the crib mattress and side rail. Only repair a crib with parts provided by the manufacturer. Makeshift repairs can create new deadly hazards. The mattress should be firm with a tight fit on all four sides and no gaps or spaces. If you can fit more than two fingers between the mattress and the crib side, your crib is unsafe. Keep monitor and other cords out of your child's reach as these cords can pose a strangulation hazard. Lower the mattress as soon as your child can push up on his or her hands and knees to prevent climbing out of the crib. Visit cpsc.gov or call the CPSC hotline to check if the crib model has been recalled. So, when selecting a crib, make sure it has not been recalled. When using the crib, regularly check to be sure all parts are secure. Don't put extra bedding or stuffed toys in the crib with an infant, and always put your baby on their back to sleep. To stay informed on the latest safety information and to receive free recall alerts, visit cpsc.gov, keepingbabiesafe.org, and aap.org. We would also like to hear from you. But if you have any concerns about a product that could pose a danger to an infant or child, contact CPSC at 800-638-2772. Now we hope you and your baby can have both a good night's sleep and a safe sleep. Sweet dreams.